Today we're gonna do skin prep before makeup. We already do makeup looks, so a lot of people were asking me on Instagram and my Twitter basically how do I prep my face before putting the primer, putting prime mix, water, whatever type of stuff that I put on my face. So we're gonna start doing that today. I'm gonna show you. And warning, basically some of the products I use is mainly because it works for my skin type um some people buy the same products and they get pimples they get acne whatever they want to call it and then they want to blame it on the person that does the video but they don't realize is people who do videos to make these skin prep videos these products work for their skin so it doesn't mean we're telling you to okay go buy this buy this you know this works amazing Everyone has different skin types, so with a great precaution, if you want to buy this and try it out, go ahead, try it out on the piece, like on one little piece side of your skin to see if you get irritated, reaction, allergies, whatever, before putting any products on your face, because I've had that problem before, so to avoid it, just put a little part of your body and see if it affects you or not, okay? So let's get started. So the first thing that I'd be using is the Sephora, Sephora, Sephora's um like their cleansing wipes. So I've been loving the coconut one. Anything with coconut I love because it's nourishing and I love the smells. It's so relaxing. So I've been using this one for face and eyes. And what I do is basically just grab one and I just wipe my face just you know any residue it's not only makeup also gunk stuck in your skin it can be a lot of you know residue left this you know the air is polluted so your skin could be clogged by pollution in the air you know different types of stuff and I love my this makes your skin feel so refreshed so I just wipe it all over my face this is eye safety. Um, this was retail, I believe, for like five to seven dollars. It's worth it. They have different types, you know, for different things. So I just go around, clean my face, and it will be so fresh. And like, it has a little bit of dirt, a little bit of makeup still. So that's why I use this first. Next thing I do is use my Marisol Maricellar cleansing water um this is from Garnier Skin Active um I love I started using this and I really like it like it really is I like but I like why can I not talk today so like a lot of Marisol waters have a little like tinted of a smell I don't like tinted of a smell especially when it comes to my eyes so this is like a little you know sample that I had and I it's been a month and I still have this much basically because I only do a drop a lot of people just drench the whole entire thing and then I get one of my little cotton pads which I got this from forever 21 three packs for two dollars yes so what I do is basically just grab a little pad and literally just a couple of drops of water in it and that's area I just do it on my nose because my nose area tends to have a lot I used to have a lot of blackheads but now I've been treating it a lot more lately and then I just go here and under my eyes just to you know pair a little bit more cleansing and that same water you just use no more like exaggerating because a lot of people exaggerate the drops and then wonder why they got to buy another one so this you could find it in your beauty supply, your CVS, pharmacy, whatever you want to go to, Dorian, Re, Rite, and then it kind of look like this. It's like 
clean because I already did the deep cleaning so so then I use my Tatcha deep cleansing because I want to have very clear pores very clean pores because I've seen that if I you know just do the wipes and the mirrors of water yeah it works but my pores are still a little bit dirty and I feel just eh. but this right here I use this as my daily like cleansing I do this once a week because also if you do too much you will have dry skin if you like you know take away the oils from your face but this is amazing like it feels you know when you see that breeze you feel that breeze and you see that freshness that's how it feels on your face clean only a little bit goes a long way with this and i'm in love with it then i just use my um lute lotus youth preserving rose cream on my face i just dot them a little bit on my face this is like the sample which is only like 12 dollars i believe and it smells so nice it's not you know that overpowering because there's a lot of moisturizers that are very overpowering and i just moisturize my skin to give a little bit of moisture in my skin and oh this right here it softens my skin to the core that it just it glows i love fresh products i'm about to buy the oil that they have and the next thing that i got in was the rose hydrating eye cream which is like a little gel and i just dip it a little bit because a little bit goes a long way and i just put it under my eyes because you know you want that concealer to glide under your eyes you don't want that shit to be you know creasing and being dry as fuck you know so i just put this under my eye let it dry and Call it a day and it has enhanced my eye structure a little bit like under my eyes has you know done that and which i have to get a new one i use the tatcha illuminators dewy skin mist and this is a serum a lot of people are using this for like dewy setting spray which i'm like um yeah so I, this is a serum so what i use i just you know pretend that oh there is something in here so I just put it on my face and it is amazing like it gives me that glowy skin you see how that glow skin and then you know you can't leave you know the lips just not being moisturized I use my milk cosmetics hero slave little lip balm thing yo when I tell you this gives your lips the moisture you need to just glide that lipstick on your lips or that lip gloss oh girl how you do this and then just keep it there until you know i just leave it there to be honest i don't remove it at all so i just do that let this dry under my eyes and then i'll start doing my prep my foundation and the regular shit guys this it for the prepping part um i'm try i'm gonna try some oils because i always like to like see oils enhancements there's a lot of them that i want to try so i'm probably gonna do a review on those but all these products will be in the description below you can find them in sephora but i'll also put the pricing of them below so if you want to try them out go ahead try them out do what you want to do but yeah i hope you enjoyed don't get why i cannot talk today don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button. Also, I wanted to, you know, I did a video regarding to the shooting in YouTube building. So I want to give my condolences to the families, the, everyone in YouTube. We all can get through this. So we got this. But yeah, guys, I see you next time. Bye. Since I always forget to say it. Go on my Instagram, follow me. I will always be posting videos. I always be posting pictures. And I always be interacting with you guys. And yeah, you know, you can find it right here or in the description below. You can either find my Twitter, my Tumblr as RoyalJewels underscore underscore. So it's the same thing. Make it easy for you guys. So yeah, now I'm deucing, okay? Now I'm leaving.